we're, we're a concierge service. We're not brokers. And we'd like to differentiate okay. ourselves because broker word can be a little offending to some. But <laughs> <laughs> Utah. <laughs> you are absolutely right. Absolutely. I agree with you. I'm just a Midwestern Midwestern country boy that's here to help a customer find a car. A call on a 2024 BM, I'm sorry, 2024 Honda HRV EXL trim for a client. She's looking for something that's compact, has heated seats, power lift gate. It's at a BMW store. That's where my tongue twist came from. Hey, good afternoon. This is Sundar Thomas with Sales. How can I help you? Yes, uh, I wanted to see if a vehicle I seen online is still available. Yeah, happy to check. Which one were you looking at, my friend? Yes. Um, what was your name? I'm sorry. It's a tricky one. I do not apologize <laughs> at all. Uh, S U N D A R. Sundar. Well, thank you for making it easy on me, not allowing me to embarrass myself. Um, I appreciate that. <laughs> I got a uh, stock number for you, brother, whenever you're ready. Yeah, perfect. R is in uh, Robert, M is in Mary, 705869T is in Tom. Thank you. You betcha. Okay, so we are looking at a 2024 Honda HRV. Is that correct? You got it. And where are you uh, calling from? Um, so calling on behalf of clients, sir. We're with I'm with Car Edge. We're a concierge service. Just to be transparent, right. again, we're not brokers. We don't have anything to charge fees wise to the dealer. Customers hire us and yeah. pay us for our services. But um, are you familiar with Car Edge? Uh, no. Not, not fully. I know Car Intelligent. If you guys are similar. No. Um, I think I have heard of them. We're similar. Yes. We're like I said, we operate like concierge. I've actually been in the business for roughly 30 years. So two car guys just trying to help a client get a, a vehicle put together. We got a, a single gal up in Seattle that's trying to source a, a, a car for she hasn't got anything for roughly 20 years. So Okay. Yeah, no, it's, it's hard to find like used cars like we have on our lots. I can't lie. We get a lot of calls from out of state. We have a bunch of low mileage and quality stuff. Cool. This right one on. is at my photo facility right now. I'm guessing it's just done with photos, and uh, we'll be heading over. So I will go run down and put eyes on it, and okay. then I can uh, give you a text back here if that works. That'd be awesome. So the number I'm calling you from, I can give it to you if you got ID there? Uh, yeah, it's uh, 309. You got it. Perfect. And then I will take uh, your name down, my friend, just to make sure I got something on my system here. You know it well. Yep, Josh Ramsey. And if you're going to text me, that'll be your best contact number, I assume? Uh, yes, sir. I was awesome. wondering, is that a good uh, cell that I can text as well? Yeah, absolutely. I prefer text. I will shoot you a text from my number here. Um, I'm going to go run out and put eyes on it, and I can send you a photo when I know it is directly here. Give me like uh, about 10 minutes. It's just on my outside lot, so. Good to go. You want to drive me down now? Perfect. I'll wait to hear back from you. Yes, sir. I will, I will uh, give you a text soon. All right. Thanks, okay. my guy. Talk to you soon. Always a pleasure when you have interactions like that. Professional, concise. Wait to hear back from him, and then we'll get an out the door on that unit. Typically, at a at a BMW store, you're not going to get a lot of fluff, but it is San Francisco, so we'll watch for some fees. The car's priced very aggressively, just roughly a thousand dollars over wholesale. So if you could send me over all the client information, I'll have them reach out to them with the price, and then they can send it over to you. You can collect the fee on your side, and we can do the deal through them. That's totally fine. Once again, I once we get the price established, that's when the customer um, gets turned over to you guys. So if you can provide us with just an out-the-door price on a worksheet, then once the customer agrees that, yes, I want to purchase the vehicle, yeah. that's when they'll get turned over to you folks. So prior to that, that's what we're here for is to do the busy work. We're concierge. We're not brokers. And as you stated, the customer okay. pays us for our service. They've already paid us. So okay. we don't need to necessarily sell a car to earn their business or we don't need to work with you to earn their business. We've already done business and we're doing business with them. Um, so just going forward, 99% uh, of the time, we always accomplish this. Once you guys provide us with the figures that confirms with them, everything's good to go. Then they get turned over to you folks. And we're just there to be a consultant for the client going forward. So I'm happy to make a cash out the door price sure. without taxes. If you send me the customer information, but I need the customer info Absolutely. on my side in order to do that. Not a problem, That's, man. Uh, hang yeah, tight exactly. here. I won't reach out to them. I'll make sure nobody does. I just need the phone number, email, blah, 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 just to put in the system. And then I'll run you a cash out the door price without taxes as if they were like shipping it off the lot. And then we can do it that way because that's no problem. Yeah, no problem at all. Can I text this number you called me from? Absolutely, man. I'm just going to take a picture. I'll put them in the, the system as a customer shipping it out. And we'll, we'll do it that way. So yeah. I'll okay. just send you a picture of all their information so that you've got it. Oh, awesome. and, and like I said, just 
send me that information. Once everything's good to go, bro, they're, they're your customer. So you guys will do, you know, run them through your finance office, do all your paperwork, hundred percent. Yeah, no. So what I'll do is I'll send it out to my driveway rep because it's a little tricky the way we do things. We're owned by Lithia, so we have driveway, which is like our out of state corporation. Sure. So I'll send all their info over to them, then they'll do most of the paperwork on their side, and then I will arrange like the shipping and everything. Because I don't mind. Trust me, I get do I get uh, commission for broker deals too. So it's like either way, I'm I'm trying to work with you guys, but uh, absolutely. We just gotta do it of a, a way around there. No, I understand completely. And and awesome. I, through the years, done a lot of business with Lithia, so no sweat. We will okay. um, always respect your guys' process and procedures. We're just here to help facilitate. That's all it is. So thank you for being patient and understanding that. And um, yeah, no I'll send you the information and then I'll just watch for uh, the worksheet with the out the door price. And I'm sure we'll get rock and rolling on this, put a deal down the road. Yes, sir. We'll make it easy. Thank you very much, Josh. You bet. As soon as I see that, I'll put it together for you. Awesome. Thank you. So, so many dealers are offended by brokers. Brokers want to take over the deal. They want to include a fee. They want the dealer to cut them back checks. That's not what we do at Car Edge. We, we, we're upfront and honest about how we make our money. We are service. We provide a service, but we're not brokers. We do not charge fees to the dealer. Just like to be transparent with that. Some dealers get very struggling with that. Certain parts of the area, brokers are very prevalent and uh, brokers don't save customers money. Glad that we were able to understand that. And going forward, it sounds like we're going to be able to put a deal together with this deal. Calling back to that BMW store on that Honda HRV, they do not want to disclose any information, no pricing. So I'm going to try to get a hold of somebody in management to figure this out. Got their employee directory. I'm going to ask for the general sales manager, see if we Thank can make some headway. BMW. This call may be recorded for quality assurance. This is Jake. I'm licensed to you. Hey, Jake. My name is Josh Ramsey. How are you, sir? I'm well, just Mr. Ramsey. Wonderful. May I speak with uh, Aaron, please? The general sales manager? Aaron? Unfortunately, Aaron is no longer the general sales manager. Oh. It is now Edwin. Okay. Edwin? Yes, Edwin. Mm-hmm. May Edwin I speak? Sh- All right. I'll put you good to you now. Thank you. Hi, this is Edwin Sarahad. Please leave a name and number and I'll get back to you. Record your message at the tone. Yes. Uh, good afternoon or good morning, Edwin. Josh Ramsey is my name. Calling um, on behalf of a mutual customer. I'm with Car Edge. We're a concierge servicer. You folks have a vehicle in stock that we're trying to get purchased. Um, the customer would like to get this vehicle purchased from you folks directly. Um, but we're just having a challenging time communicating with your sales staff. Uh, if you wouldn't mind, give me a call back so that we can communicate. Thank you. Hopefully he gives me a call back. We'll see. Josh, this is Rod. I'm the sales manager here. And I was asked to reach out to you. First of all, I want to apologize that we haven't been responsive to your request. Are you the client or are you the broker? Yeah. So, golly, thank you for such the kind phone call. I thank you sincerely. Um, To to just just to explain myself and be a little more transparent. we're a concierge service. We're not brokers. And we'd like to differentiate okay. ourselves because I am a dealer, been in the business for many years. And the broker word can be a little offending to some. But <laughs> <laughs> No, I like the way you talk. <laughs> you are absolutely right. Absolutely. I agree with you. I'm just a Midwestern Midwestern country boy that's here to help a customer find a car. We A single gal that hasn't bought a car in 20 years and she just needs some direction. So she pays us for our service and our and our and our years of knowledge and expertise. So um, I actually cut my teeth as a young man on BMW. So I have a fond passion for them myself. But we're looking at a Honda in this case, um, a little HRV. And we just have had a little bit of a struggle. I just want to get a, a worksheet or a bill of sale. I'm familiar with all the deals in California. You're not going to offend me with anything. So that way we can present that to her. If she likes the figures and thinks it's a go, she's going to buy the car from you guys. And she does buy it from you, goes through your finance department, the whole nine yards. Okay, so here's a question that I have for you. Where is she located? She's located in the state of Washington. Okay, so I will send you over a buyer's awareness, you know, as far as the breakdown of the vehicle is cost and things of that nature. Let me go into my database here. Let's see. I'm a Midwesterner too. I'm a Chicago imp. Oh, very cool. For almost 40 years. So how about yourself? Well, where, so where are you located? grew up about two and a half hours south of Chicago. So yeah. been to the city a lot. That's a beautiful city. Okay. Absolutely. Enjoyed a lot of, a lot of different experiences. What's that? Yeah. 
Well, you can't money. <laughs> it's like New York. Yeah. It's like LA. All of these big metropolitan cities, if you're broke, it ain't so pretty. No, no, you're, it's a beautiful city to visit. That's what I always said. I, you got to keep your wall close. So it's not that you get thieved, but for somehow it gets drained every time you show up to that town. No doubt, <laughs> no doubt. Okay, let me go into my database here. You said it's a Honda, you said it's a CRV? HRV. I've got a stock number okay. if you need it. When did you reach out to my team here? Because these are teachable moments because I've been trying to tell these guys that, you know, we have to be a lot more conscientious of people that have the money in their pockets. They want to spend it. And we can't be very lax in yeah. our approach. So sometimes they are. What is the stock number? Let's start there. Yeah. So um, since yesterday, I mean, uh, to be honest, and they were just very, very cautious on sharing information with me at the tune of that I was a broker. And I understand. So. I'm glad that you're concerning, but yeah, as I think as time evolves, there's going to become more folks that are interested in getting help or assistance and buying a car, not necessarily a, using a broker. That. The stock, I, I agree with that. The stock number is RM seven zero five eight six nine T is in Tom. Okay. HRV 2024. The only thing that the customer would have to give us dollar wise would be the sale price plus $85 documentation fee plus $118 for all of the ancillary out-of-state registration. So so the car's 24998. Hang on one second. Mm -hmm. and, and obviously, I'll send this over to you in writing. Thank you. 24998. And then you got 118 plus $85 for documentation. So 25201 is the number. Perfect. Perfect. Um, that will, I mean, I'm going to go ahead and say that's 99% going to be fine. She's, she's approved the unit, the pricing, we've discussed it. Um, I've, I've told her it's a good deal as long as there wasn't, mm -hmm. you know, a $2,000 nitrogen tire charge or something along those lines. But, no, uh, no, um, we, don't, we don't have any, um, any ancillary products. We preload some things, but it's all based on activation. Like we preload a GPS tracking system, but if you don't want it, we don't activate it. <laughs> so right. It's um, you know, pretty pretty straightforward here. Lithia right. wants to make sure that their reputation remains, you know, clean. Yeah, no, that's outstanding. I, I've sourced a, f a handful of deals through the years through Lithia, and always okay. been always been a pleasure. No complaints. So. Um, look forward to doing the same again with you guys. I do you have my email address? Can I provide provide that to you so you can um, shoot that over to me? Provide that to me. Okay. What I'm going to do is this: I I won't be the one sending it over to you. I'm going to have Tomas. Mm -hmm. He's one of my top um, client advisors because he needs to reach out to Driveway and kind of navigate the process with them for you. And Josh, um, is this your cell number? Yes, sir. All right, I'm going to jot that down. Let me give you my cell number because I'm calling you from my desk line right now. Okay. All right, Josh. I'll get this handled for you, and we will contact you within the next 20 minutes or less. Outstanding. Thank you, sir. I look forward to putting this deal together for you guys. My pleasure. Talk to you soon. Bye now. So that's pretty cool. Love it when you get a call from a manager like that at a store you've had a little bit of struggle with. So a guy that recognizes who we are and what we're doing for the customer um, appreciates our service, quite frankly. So uh, so looking forward to this. This is going to be great. Customer's going to get a great deal. There's no fees. This unit's priced uh, within a few hundred dollars of wholesale. It's going on a recorded line. How are you doing today? Doing wonderful, Nathan. I'm sorry. Nate, what did you say your first name was? Nathan. Yeah. Nathan. Good to go. Thank you for uh, calling. Yeah, of course. Uh they reached out to us here, uh, driveway.com, of course, uh, their parent company, Lithium, online platform. Looks like you're interested in just a beautiful red Honda HRV that they have there. Correct, yes. Yeah, yeah. Well, man, I'll just kind of give you a, a quick rundown about Driveway before we jump into the greens of this year. Uh, but yeah, driveway.com, we're an online platform for Lithium. So we do specialize on taking care of the full purchase process of our vehicles, as well as we'll ship them all across the state directly to your driveway. Uh, and once you do receive it, you actually get a seven-day, 400-mile money-back guarantee window with it to make sure it fits exactly what you're looking for. Excellent. Sounds wonderful. Um, and just yeah. to be transparent with you as well, I appreciate your introduction, Nathan. Uh, I'm with Car Edge. We're a concierge service. So we're just helping facilitate the deal for a client. We've we've done many deals with you folks, and we appreciate your business and how you guys operate very much. We will definitely follow along with the, the procedures. Wendy, the, the customer, definitely looks forward to um, getting her new vehicle. Gotcha. Okay. So, so just to make sure. 
for you, Josh, are a concierge service for a customer for looking to help them purchase this HRV. Correct. Yes, they are purchasing it from you guys. We're not any like a broker or nothing like that. Um, we're just here helping facilitate the process for the client. Okay, gotcha. Well, let me go ahead here and get it pulled up. Now, you, you said the customer's name was Wendy. Yes, Wendy. The, uh, we and- did provide the information to the dealer, her address, email, all the uh, information. So I hope you've got that. Um, it looks like they only sent over your information here. Uh, maybe the, the Wendy's information got lost somewhere in translation, but I should be able to get that from up here in those uh, So just to make sure, uh, Wendy is checking out this HRV. Where, what state is Wendy located in? Washington. She, okay, she's up in Washington. Gotcha. And, you, and you said that you have helped facilitate purchases through driveway.com before? Uh, lithium driveway both, actually, yes. Gotcha. Okay, great. Um, so, yeah, you, you should kind of already know the process. Now, now typically, um, I, I haven't worked with the concierge service before. We always just typically do business with the customer directly here. Mm-hmm. Um, and we, of course, do have to you know collect documents from Wendy yep. uh, at one point process or another. Yeah. Um, but just so I can go ahead. Oh, go ahead. Sorry. Just to, yeah, just to explain our process or however it works, we, we will turn the client over to you to complete the purchase. We just need to try to get the deal set up for her. Basically do the busy work. So at this point, if you guys could provide us with a worksheet or some figures, uh, you know, the, uh, the transportation quote and all that, so that we can go over that and we can answer any questions for her. And then at that point, once she's ready to move forward and complete the purchase, she's all yours. We're just there to be a consultant for her at that point to help the process go smooth. Okay, yeah, I, I could definitely do that. Um, and is she looking to finance this HRV purchase in cash, bring it in or her own lender? Uh, she would prefer to finance it. Uh, so she would look uh, look at what you guys would have to offer her. So if you guys could share with us a, a link to a finance application, that'd be great. Yeah, yeah, I, I can send over a, a manual application for this HRV to have her fill out. Um, now, you, you can let her know it is, of course, based on credit score, as you know. Um, yeah, our sure. good credit customers right now are getting mostly between the, the high debit to 10, just through, through our, our in-house banks here, either driveway finance or like Wells Fargo Chase, because we do have all the banks. Uh, so that, that's, if she's in good credit standing, she should be right in that range somewhere. Yeah, we just did a, just did a deal for a customer that Wells Fargo was involved with, and I think they got six and a quarter percent. Yeah, Wells has been coming through with, with some great rates as of late, uh, but it's very few and far between the ones we've noticed. I've seen, I think, a, a low sevens from Wells. Um, like one of my other coworkers said that they actually saw a five come through, uh, but I haven't haven't quite seen anything that low in a while. Excellent. Yeah. No, that would be great. That's that's wonderful to hear that you guys have some options for her. Yeah. So I, I can go ahead then. I can get this manual application made. Um, and then should I send it to you or should I send it to Wendy directly? Um, you can go ahead and forward it to me. And then that way we've got each other's contact information. And I can actually email you all of hers if you'd like once I receive that. Yeah. Yeah. Let me go ahead. I'm going to send you just a, a generic email. That way we have an email point of contact. Sure. No uh, problem. If you could reply and send back her contact information, that'd be great. Um, I'll start working on that. That manual application link and then get that sent over to you again a little bit, okay? Thank you very much. I appreciate your help, Nathan. Hey, thank you as well. We'll talk soon. You bet. Bye bye. There we go. One of the phone calls I've been waiting for. Driveway makes it pretty easy. They're familiar with the whole process of a remote deal. So they're set up for it and we'll just hook right along with their uh, steps that they have and make sure that everything goes as, a, as appropriate. Client does want to get a post-sale inspection or a PPI. So we'll get that squared away. And that is an update on the Honda HRV.